And the score wasn't, bruh, the score wasn't big. Like, he was locking my tackles and everything. Like, he, like, in the fourth quarter, that's when he started scoring and shit. He was getting his breaks and shit, like, for real. Like, I ain't gonna lie, I was getting breaks. I don't know how I was causing certain fumbles. And I, th I, I think the equalizer is real, but it is what it is. Like, just give me my respect. They said it's a GG movement, good game, good game movement, and that's it. But how you gonna say good game and then just talk a whole bunch of shit? Like, why y'all using that as an excuse? But nobody was saying nothing about him locking my tackles, sending all these A gaps, running PA end around on me. Nobody said shit. But just because I was in the stream, I wasn't even like, I was calling my plays, fam. I wasn't even like lurking and shit, trying to see what he's calling and shit like that. Bro, you could tell what somebody's running right on the play when this tells you how many running backs, how many tight ends, how many receivers. I pay attention to that shit. That's how I play Madden. And if you constantly running the same shit, bro, he was running PA and around me two drives straight. And you know it's going to say two running backs, this and that, this and that, this and that. Of course I'm going to be ready for it. Of course I'm going to know what's coming. Like, niggas just be making excuses, fam. Because I follow him. So I looked on my Twitch, and it said he was streaming. So I'm like, okay. Like, I'm like, okay, let me see what he's saying. Let's see if people know it's me. Because, I w look, I'm an upcoming streamer. I want to know what people, like, how people feel about me, you know? See if they say like he needs to do this more or something. I'm trying to learn, especially from him. Like he's he's the number one player. So I'm like, okay, like he's streaming and shit. I'm about to like whatever, get off and shit. I see somebody in the chat talking about some yo. Run PA end around on him. He's gonna quit. Let me look at to y'all. He was running PA end around. He was locking my tackles. Sending A gaps and B gaps. He had two clock on in the first quarter. Two clock on. Running PA and around, locking my tackles, this and that. And when I ended up winning, I told him good game. And there was a dude from the jump that was like, oh, you playing Shaba. Just run PA and around, he's going to quit. So after the game, I told, I told Seattle, good game. And then I called out, dude, I guess dude is his mind. And I was like, bruh, I thought I was going to quit. And then everybody try to switch it around and say, oh, he been lurking the stream, this and that, this and that. I'm like, don't get me wrong. I ran PA in the round too because he did it to me. And the times I did it, it was successful. The times I did it was successful. And I wasn't trying to do it, but he did it. He was doing it the whole drive back to back to back to back to back. But he did all that cheesy shit. I, I still won. You feel me? I held my ground, but I'm wrong because I was in the stream. I don't get no respect for that win because I was in the stream. Motherfuckers could lock my tackles, cheese, all it. Motherfucker having mozzarella, having a fucking cheese party in this motherfucker, mac and cheese. I got the blues in this bitch. Do all of that. But just because I'm in the stream, I get no respect. Fuck the respect. Credit. Like, yo, Shaba, good shit, man. You played... You played through, you didn't quit, this and that. Niggas was already telling him, just run this, he gonna quit. I was quitting the day before because I'm tired of the Madden community. Why I'm gonna play people who just gonna run PA and around and exploit the game? Why waste my time when I could play somebody go play this game straight up? You feel me? But just because um, I'm in the stream, I you don't deserve that when you don't get no credit. How, you know how many streamers, if you streamers, you gonna play people like that regardless. If you, especially if you're number one, people gonna be in your stream, and it's delayed anyway. So it's not like I'm watching your stream and be like, "What he calling? What he calling? Can't do that shit." And then that's how I go. I was gonna quit, but I was like, as you can see, the other day I quit because I was like, "Oh, it's Uni Seattle, but I know I can't beat him, and I'm not trying to deal with the bullshit." But then yesterday, the first game I tried, and it was him. So I was like, "Fuck it, man. Might as well get a game in." I was, just give me my credit. You ain't even got to respect me, man. Because I know for damn sure I ain't going to get respect from nobody in this fucking community like that. Not everybody. Everybody's telling me, like, yo, Shaba, like, don't even trip. Like, people going to hate you regardless. You can't make everybody hate you or love you and shit like that. I understand that. But when it comes down to credit and respect... You ain't even got to fuck with me. Just say, you know what, Shaba... 
good game, bro. You did your shit, fam. You did your shit. You did your shit. Because me being in the stream has nothing to do with the gameplay, fam. I still got to pick a play. I still got a user. I still got to do all of this shit. I still got to call plays. If you win, it's always a good game with an excuse behind it. You feel me? Nobody want to be like, yo, you did your shit. Like, good game, bro. Like, you held your own. Like, you did what you had to do. Nope. I just want you to say, yo, Shaba, you did your shit. You held your own. Even though I was cheese dicking the fuck out of you. You feel me? You earned your win. Please. Can't even get that. It's all good, though, man. I'm still crispy, so I ain't tripping.